Hi, hi, hello friends, welcome to my channel. I'm Jolene, I like to share all things beauty, shopping, decor, and more. I love to share um, beauty finds that I have, and also right now I'm really excited because I'm sharing a lot of fun things, some gift ideas and things um, for, for the holidays and whatnot. So I did happen to shop from the VIB cell at Sephora, and so I want to share some of the things I got there. Um, anyway, so that's what this video is about. I got a Sephora, I got the bag, and a big box full of stuff. So anyway, let's get to it. Okay, friends. Um, I First, I want to just thank you for being here. I appreciate your support. I would love it if you'd subscribe, hit the like button, do those things that support my channel if you wish. And if you're already a subscriber, thank you so much again for your support. And so, Sephora. Um, I don't know where to start. Maybe I'll just start with... I happen to be wearing some of this stuff from Sephora. So I'm the first thing I was super excited to get and they, they were actually out of stock um, when I ordered. And so I um, kept checking it every day and it came back in and I was actually able to get this same day delivery. So I just got this today. I ordered it um, last night. And so this is the Icy Nude Palette from Huda Beauty. Um, really exciting. I love nude palettes. Um, Icy Nude is even better because I like to wear cool tones. And this is the palette. It's very beautiful. You can get a good look at it there. And so... I want to say that you can tell I've already dug into it. So I am actually wearing this on my eyes. Um, I had to, it, it was a learning, um, you know, I didn't really try before I started wearing. So I just picked like I, so I did um, on my, on my crease, I did this color and this color this one right here and this one so these two and then i think i did these two in my in the corners here the outer outer corners then i did this one it was kind of a white i tried it in the inner corners and it was like a purple purple pink which it didn't look bad with the colors i had on but it just wasn't the look i specifically wanted so i also took this um there's a golden color up here in the corner right here these are shimmers. I took this to, to the middle of my eye right here. And, and then I took, um, I kind of played around with some of these shimmers in my corners. So this, 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 anyway. So it's really a beautiful palette. I'm really excited to have it. It's probably going to be my go-to. Um, I need to pick about... I have so many palettes, but I need to pick about five or six that are just right there, my go-tos. You know, I always, I love the pink look, so I wear that a lot. So anyway, I have that on. This is exciting. I would recommend it. It's a very pricey, um, it is a pricey palette. I mean, it's $69, but I got it on sale. So that, that was good. The next thing I got that I am wearing, I wanted to try these, so I just got, they had this kit, this um, Mario from Mario. Um, it was a blush and bronze stick, which I love sticks. I love them. So I am also wearing this today. And I'm happy to say I'm picky about my bronzers, but I love this bronzer. I love it. Um, that's what it looks like. Um, I When I bronze, I like boop, boop, boo, all around my face, my nose. I mean, I bronze. So, and I love a good bronzing stick because that's the easiest way to, to apply it. So, and then um, we have the blush here. I also used this today. The color wasn't quite what I wanted, but, um, and it was okay. It's an okay blush. It's just, um, I would say the bronzer is outstanding. The blush is it's okay. I mean, it's good. It's very good, but there's a lot of blushes, you know, so as far as competing, I don't know. 
Um, I bet I would recommend this set right here as set. They have them in different colors, but I would definitely recommend this to someone. Uh, I think it's, um, it was a good buy and it's, sticks are great. And these are smaller ones, but they, you could also use them to travel or whatever. So I do have that on. So that is the next thing I got. The next thing I have on that I got, this is Makeup Forever and I've been hearing about their lip pencils. And let me tell you guys, it's true. These are absolutely wonderful lip pencils. I, was it a week ago or a week and a half ago or something? I, I remember saying, all of my lip pencils are crap. Like seriously, I, I was sick of it. And so I've been on a lip pencil hunt. And so I heard about these, bought it, love it. It's a good color. It goes really well with um with what I the lip product I have on. And I'm gonna tell you my lip product, even though I didn't buy it because I, I already had these. I actually buy these on Amazon, but this is the the NYX. Um it says lingerie lin lingerie. It doesn't lingerie anyway, XXL. So this I love this color too. I um if I remember, I'll put the link to this for you. But this stuff stays and lasts forever. And it's a beautiful color. I, I can't say enough good things about it. And it's it's reasonably priced. So um, I think it's to get the big one. This one, I think it's $10 to $15 maybe. But comparing to other lip products, good lip products, it's definitely um, less expensive. I will continue to buy these. This has been my holy grail, actually. I, I use a lot. I love lip products, and I use a lot of different ones, but this one right here, anyway, chef's kiss. Hmm, it's really good. So, there's that. Um, anyway, so, and you probably get that at Sephora, too, on the sale. Okay, so the next few things I have here, I'll just show this real quick. I, I showed this in a video before. This is the Laneige lip kit it's $21 this stuff I use it every night like every night before I go to bed it's like it's like the last thing I do before I go to bed and the first thing I do when I get up I love this stuff so good for your lips it doesn't have um the stuff that makes your lips white or whatever you know anyway it's it's just a really good um formula and there's six different flavors in here. So these will last me, well, I guess it's only five. So I think, um, I think one lasts me about two months, maybe. So anyway, this should get me through about 10 months. I did buy a couple extras because I'm going to give one as gift. I don't know if I'm going to keep two of them just so I have them on stock for my year's, a year supply of them or whatever. But anyway, there's that. So the next thing, I don't know what to show you next. Okay, um, I kind of splurged and I always wear Victor Rolf Flower Balm. That is my scent and I still love it. I always love it, but I just kind of want to try something else bougie, you know. And when I first smelled the Valentino, the, um, this is the... Um, why did it go blank? This is the coral, the uh, Valentino, the coral, and that's what the bottle looks like. Anyway, I broke down and got it, and it also came with a purse size too, which I love. So I'm excited. It's something new, something different. So I put it on earlier and I do really like it but you know what you guys my flower bomb is just I can't beat it I, I keep trying to find something that beats it but I don't even think this beats it but this is fun for something different and then I just had another video um from uh Allure Beauty where I got a Fenty the new Fenty scent and Rihanna's scent and it is smells so good and we got like a purse size of that also and so I'm excited to use that so perfumes I don't know I'm kind of into perfumes right now but trying some different stuff so that was that was a splurge but I figure I get 20% off and I like that it had a you know you basically paid the price for 
the full size, but it also had the purse size in it. They always do like gift gift boxes around the holidays. So I got that. So the next thing I got is from Glow Recipe. This is was $30. And this is Dewy Skin Dazzlers. There we go. And the reason why I got this, I actually love these products, but I have, I'm going to run out because of all the, um, this niacinamide glow serum, this, the darker, um, kind of the bronzing. Let's see here. This is one of my favorite products right here. I have the large size and I'm going to run out of it because I use this almost every day. I mix this in my foundation. It works perfect. It's not super, li I mean, it's liquidy, but it has a little bit of substance to it. So it mixes well with the foundation. I wanted a smaller size because I am traveling and I want to take it, but I, I like the smaller size for traveling. So I just saw this as a as a decent deal for $30 because Glow Recipe can be expensive. So the, they're just all um, dewy skin dazzlers in it. And so we got, this one's a spray. And this one is, let me see what it is exactly we got in here. Okay, Watermelon Glow Ultra Fine Mist, um, Watermelon Hyaluronic Acid, and Hibiscus to Refresh and Soften Skin. The, uh, the, these are the Watermelon Glow Dew Drops right here. And then the third thing I have here is the Watermelon Glow Niacinamide Hue Drops. So this is a multi-use brightening serum. So um, anyway like it this is fun um it can be a good travel kit too if you like these products so there's that i'm still going you guys i kind of went a little crazy could have gone crazier but um there's two things here okay so one i haven't had this but i've heard so much on till dawn this one size setting spray i hear that it lasts like 24 hours or whatever and I just want to use it every day from now on I I like I'm going to try to start I haven't done this but I'm going to try to start doing a setting spray like doing my makeup and then or my face face and then do a spray I'm not sure like one of my other sprays I have and then do my whole makeup and use this spray so I already used some of this today, but I put it on again. So my makeup's not going anywhere for a while. So anyway, there's that. I went ahead and bought the large one. This one's more pricey. I think this is 40 something dollars, 48 maybe, but you get so much more than the smaller ones. It's like definitely the value, the value's there. So I went ahead, I'm like, oh, okay, 10 more dollars. I'll just get the big one because it's like twice as much. So anyway, there's that. And then I saved something for last and I have not opened this yet. So I am going to be surprised with you. But I, when I saw this, it was kind of a holiday thing and it wasn't, I think it wasn't available in stores. I think you had to buy this online. This is a Natasha Denova. It's called the Roxa palette right there. And it is kind of purples, which aren't my def, totally my thing, but it's kind of pink too. And there we go. That's what it looks like. I just couldn't resist um, a good, just a Natasha Denona palette. So I'm going to pick some of these colors that look good to me. I'm going to pick some of the pinks first because I really like pink. So I'm going to do this one, this one. Um, let's do this one. And this one. Okay, so there's four different ones there. They're really pretty. This this is going to be really pretty. Um, there's also a... 
fingers cleaned off here. There's also, I there's like a purple one in the middle here. That looks interesting. Uh, it's kind of got a purple and silver. Look at that. It's got the dots. I don't know. Maybe these will look better just on my fingers. Um, here's a purple. And here's a purple. So there's three purples right there. So those are pretty. And then let's take some of these. There's a few neutrals. So let's try the neutrals. Um, so let's try this one, this one, this one. So those are pretty. They look a little different. This one looks a little bit more pink or red than it did it almost look more neutral on on here but um there's just some pretty ones so there's another color there so I think we're gonna have some fun looks with this palette so I am excited about it I know Natasha Denona once again they're 69 too but if I get it on the sale then I don't feel quite so bad about, about it but Anyway, I'm excited. I'm excited for it. It looks really fun. Um, some really fun colors. And I'll do some fun looks. So maybe I'll do a video with um, featuring that. So I can't wait. Actually, I can't wait to use it. So anyway, got lots of filming to do. But though, So that's basically my um, Sephora. What I got in the VIB cell. Once again, the Dewey Dazzlers, um, the from Glow Recipe. I got the Natasha Denona palette, this beautiful purples and pinks and a few neutrals. I got this ice, uh, icy nude from Huda Beauty. Love, love it, um, which I'm wearing. I got the Mario, the makeup, the blush and bronzer cream. I got the um, Beauty for Real lip pencil. I got the one size uh, spray and I got the Laneige. The, these are great gifts if you want to pick these up. These are a really good gift. And also, da da, perfumes. So, anyway, it's kind of a fun little mix of things. Uh, I usually wait, I usually get my. I usually get perfume in the fall, like once a year when they, when they have their sale, I usually try to pick up a nice big thing of perfume. So I'm excited to have something different and new to try. Anyway, so that's it for Sephora. Tell me what you think. Did you guys shop the Sephora, the VIB sale? Um, what are you eyeing at Sephora? It's I have so much product and yet I still get really excited when there's a sale because I like to try new things. So this time... I mean, I did, I had never had Mario makeup. Um, the Who, I don't even have a Huda Beauty palette. So that was kind of new to me. So um, a few things, the Beauty For Real was new for me. So I got some samples. I, I did get a Tula moisturizer, a night moisturizer, which I like. And then just like a, a Dior, um, a Dior foundation and just a Rare Beauty um, concealer sample. Nothing super spectacular there. But anyway, um, that's it. So thank you guys for being here. And I will see you guys all in the next one. All right, friends. Bye-bye.